Hi guys, my name is Isa. Today, we're going to learn how to make a flower using Python Turtle. Anyways, so, what we're going to do is save from Turtle, import everything. I'm also going to write from color sys, which means color system imports HSV to RGB. So, uh, we're going to use that sync later, but for now, I just set the Turtle thing. I'm gonna put turtle.done here. Oh yeah, uh, since I put the I should just write done. So it just plays the screen. So I'm gonna say BG color black. This is the background color to black. I'm gonna say pen size 8. Um, which you can't really see, so let me just add a forward 10 over here. So you'll be able to see the changes there's do anything because we have to put pen down so we're gonna have to like pen down before moving or doing anything mm. oh yeah let's just get the pen color because yeah the pen color is already black so as you can see it, it moves so yeah in the end i'm gonna say Height turtle. So we're gonna remove the object after doing this. But if I write forward 100, you can see that it takes a while to get to the 100, uh, 250. So we can write speed 0 or just the speed 0. So now it does that immediately, almost. So, anyways. Let's get rid of this forward 250. Let's start doing it. So for I in range uh, 15, for J in range 25. Let's go right past here for now. Oh yeah, let's we'll say uh, for I in range 255 for J in range 15. Uh, no, for J in range 4. So I'm gonna say. Oh yeah, the reason I said 255 because they're uh 255 called colors or single or whatever. So yeah. I'm gonna say uh color HSV to RGB means hue saturation brightness. The hue will be I. The saturation, oh yeah, I divided by ten or something. Saturation will be J divided by fifteen. The uh, brightness will be zero point eight. No, it doesn't look like anything. So let's write um, forward 10. Now we're able to see. As you can see, it changes the color a lot of times. Anyways, I'm going to write circle 200 minus i. So it does that. I'm going to say write 90. I was gonna do this, I guess. You know, it doesn't look like a flower, anyways. So, 100 minus J multiplied by 4. And let's say 90. So, as you can see, it does this thing, which um, you really want. So I'm gonna copy this. Say left 90. I'm gonna keep everything else the same. So now it does this. I'm not gonna say right 180. Um, now it doesn't really do anything. So I'm going to add circle. So the radius will be 50. And just between four. So now as you can see it draws a flower. We can or edit, edit the values a bit if you want it. So um, let me close this so somehow or whatever. So, like, for example, I can change the pen size to like 20 or something. And the will be, become noticeably more thicker. And we could also change this from i divided by 10 to just i. And from j divided by 15 to just j. 
Um, but, um, well, yeah, that doesn't work because it has to be from zero point, so from zero to one. And you could do it like this, even though if it's like that, I always chose red color, so if it doesn't, I guess. Before it's all divided by 25. You can see that uh, since the hue is changing, the color is also changing. So instead of doing, instead of doing that, I could just uh, make a variable called C. C would be equal to zero. So here, C plus equals um one divided by two hundred fifty-five. So here, I'm gonna write C. Um, yeah, it's not really changing that much. It is changing, but it's not really that noticeable. So if it changes to 50, you see it will be one divided by 50. So now, it should change faster. Uh, yeah, I was right. As you can see, the colors are changing faster. If you wanted, you could make it more darker. But before that, it would be just change to 20. So, if you made it more darker, um, like, if it says 0 0.8, it would be 0 0.5. As you can see, it's a more darker. Um, yeah, anyways, let's just change it back to like 0 0.75 or something. I don't have the perfect color. Anyways, that's going to be the end of today's tutorial. If you enjoyed, leave a like and subscribe. So, bye.